Hi, I'm Mike from Michaels Motor Cars, located in Lancaster, Pennsylvania, and very pleased to show you a car we recently acquired that we're offering for sale. Come on over and take a look at it. This car is a 1926 Model T Roadster pickup, and we've had a number of Model Ts, and each one is a little individual. This car, first of all, it's a 26, so it's very near the end of the Model Ts, so it has all the improvements and advancements that a Model T would have had in 26. But this particular truck is just loaded with all kinds of cool accessories. So coming to the front of it, of course we have the motometer temperature and it's working correctly. The other part, as I talk about this truck, everything works on this truck and works quite well. It's an older restoration. It has some patina going on in the paint, some cracking. So the paint has some patina. The chrome and trim is very nice. The lenses are gorgeous. I love the fluted Ford lenses. It has additional springing in the front suspension. I actually am not a Model T expert by any means, so I don't know what the term is for this, but in addition to the regular leaf, it has these coil springs, which are additional. Coming along to the side of the car, of course, it has electric start. It also was converted to a 12 volt system. So this is the most energetic Model T I've ever experienced as far as how it starts. It just cranks quickly and starts right up, being a 12, being a 12 volt. Of course, we also have the water pump, which is very nice, our horns. And then coming along the side of the car, the running board, the owner had these cans. So I believe they're water, gas, and I think oil. I'll leave that to the Model T people to tell us. We have three of those brightly painted. We have the side wings on it. Of course, the windshield that opens up. And then inside the car is where it really gets interesting. We do have the Fat Man tilting steering wheel, which works properly. And this car is unique. It has a Ruxtel two-speed rear, which is the lever over there. So the two-speed rear end on the car. But then additionally, and I personally have never seen this before, we've got the Warford three-speed transmission. So this car, if you want an interesting Model T, this is one to really consider. You have the normal Model T driving with your left pedal balancing between low and high. And then you have the low and high range of the rear end, which is a, a normal option. But then you have, on top of that, the three-speed transmission. So safe to say you have a lot of choices in the gears you want to be in and how you want to drive this car. We do have the top is in excellent condition. We do have the metal rods, but we do not have the side curtains for it. Coming along the back of the car, back of the truck, the wooden wheels are in great shape. The tires are in great shape. We've driven this quite a bit. It's actually a hoot to drive. It just, it's just a learning experience to drive this smoothly. And I'll do a driving video for you to take a look at. The bed was refinished. The wood is in very nice condition. It does have, it's already pre-wired for a 12 volt charging. You can have a, a battery charger on the truck. Spare tire down here. And then here we have Model T toolkit and the tools that come with it. In this box, we have another set of the cans that go along the side of the truck. So this all comes with it. These are the metal rods for the side curtains. And again, we don't have the fabric, we just have the rods. Coming along this side of the truck, pretty much the same. It really has a lovely patina. Uh, it's shiny, uh, it's not perfect, it's a truck. Uh, but overall, it has held up extremely well. The restoration that was done on this was very well done. Please look at all the photos we will take of it. We'll have a lot of chassis photos. It also has, as we start listing this stuff, we have a generator on this truck, we have a water pump on this truck, we have electric starter, we have 12 volts, we have the two-speed rear, we have this three-speed transmission, and as if that weren't enough, yes, it has the Rocky Mountain rear brakes also, which are especially nice. So if you happen to lose your drive shaft or something bad happens, you're still going to have the rear brakes. So the Rocky Mountain brakes are on this truck also. This is the toolkit where normally the toolkit would have been kept. We have an old jack, and I've never seen this before, but these are, I believe, uh, anti-theft boots that you put on the wheels. And they're really cool. Security auto theft signal system. So there's three of these. So if you're worried about 
somebody actually figuring out how to drive a Model T and attempting to steal it, you can put those boots on. On this side, you can see the seat surfaces are in very nice condition. The wood on the floor is excellent. Overall, the truck presents itself very well. And it's really, I mean, uh, the, the pickups like this are fun and interesting. You'll see from our driving video, this one is very nice to drive. With all those gears, you can do it much, it's capable of much higher speeds than a Model T normally could have done. And then you have a super low range also. So if you're looking for a fun Model T pickup that someone just checked all the boxes and the accessories, uh, please consider this one. It's very nice. Ask us any questions you may have. We'll be happy to answer them. And thanks for coming and looking at our truck.